This conference will now be recorded. Hello everyone, welcome in my channel. First of all, so please subscribe my channel for BTP updates. If you will subscribe, then you can get all the my latest video on BTP. Okay. So today we will see how we can create SAP Cloud Database for creation of any BTP application. So for any BTP app development, first of all, first time we need to create our SAP Cloud Database. Okay. So let's see. So after creation of your account, you need to go here in your sub account. Then first step I have already explained in my previous video for creation of dev spaces. Okay. So if once you will create your development space, then second step is to create your SAP Cloud database for the BTP application development. So you can get option inside spaces. So just click on spaces. So uh, I have created here two uh, the BTP development space. So go on any one. Then you can see here SAP HANA Cloud option. So just click once on SAP Cloud. Then uh, if you are creating your first time SAP Cloud database, so it will come in blank here. I have already created, so that's why it is visible here. So just go on create option and click on SAP HANA database. Then select this first option. Go next step. Then you can see what are the memory allocated by SAP. So by default, your trial account will come here, and you have to select your space here. And instance name, just give some development name. Then click on next step uh, yeah one thing main your by default user id will come db admin for your uh, hana administrator as a it, it is a hana administrator user id so by default it will be a db admin and you have to provide your password here so just provide password as per the naming standard is coming here remember this password whenever on the HANA DB level you have to do any work so this is your user ID and password so click on next step Allow here all the IP addresses. Next step review and create. Create instances. You are creating SAP HANA database instance. So after creating this, whenever you will develop your any application so it will store here so once successfully your DB will create so you can see this message once you will go in your trial home account so you can see here your date your DB <coughs> created already so in action part you can see you have option to view the uh, existing table on it 
uh, whatever the development you will do so you can see here so it is same like uh, in eclipse and hana studio we have option or uh, we can see the created schema tables so same like that you can see here catalog database the da files here you can see all the you have options here table view you can write your statement so in this way uh, you have to create your hana cloud database so hope this video will help you to create sap cloud database okay. so keep watching my channel and please subscribe and share it thanks for watching my channel